All right, so today uh, out in beautiful uh, Indio, Palm Springs area, and um, I'm gonna show you how we stake uh, house corners, building corners, building envelopes, whatever, and um, kind of how we do it, and, uh, and if you're not a surveyor, how to read the stakes. So depending on how hard the dirt is, um, we'll either use 60D nails if the dirt's hard. Uh, this is all sand out here, but um, it's a soft crust, but gets pretty hard once it's compacted and um, or we'll use one by two stakes or hubs whatever you want to call it um, for larger buildings uh, we do like to use um, hubs either one by twos or uh, two by twos and tack them and that's just so that if they do get disturbed or hit um, you know you can tell and uh, when we do use nails we use them just because they're temporary uh, they're gonna jump on these pretty quick and uh, before you know it you know they'll be framing them and um, you know then we certify the forms but they usually jump on these things pretty quick so there's they're they're used to the nails and um, again as long as they hold a grade as long as the ground is hard they work fine but you know use whatever your company wants you to use on the stakes themselves you're normally going to have an offset uh, if you elevate the uh, nail or hub you're going to have probably a cut or fill to the finished floor or whatever you're grading it to and then on the back, um, you know, sometimes we put down point numbers. If if we use a plot as a uh, as a cut sheet, um, then you know we'll give them a copy of this and then throw the point numbers on there. So basically, what you're looking at here is our elevation. We usually put down the tens of feet, but um, we're in Palm Springs, so we are only 66 feet above sea level. So 6641, point number 476, lot 13. And that's how we write offset. So five foot, one line. I know some people do two lines, whatever, whatever works for you. Um, and uh, building an envelope, and it's a uh, fill of uh, 7800 finished floor. What a building envelope is. So you can see right here, um, that little circle is our offset point, five foot offset. So that'd be a five foot offset to the building corner. But if you look over here to the other side, 0.477, that's a five foot offset to this building line and this building line protruding out. So that's the building envelope. It's the envelope of the whole building. So our five foot offset is, is to that. So we give them um, four five foot offsets. That's what our contract says. And um, so if, if you're the one laying out this building, that's what an envelope is. Um, you know, talk to the surveyor. Uh, sometimes whatever's in the contract is, uh, you know, uh, it could maybe be negotiated. Because we've worked on, on um, jobs where they only wanted two offsets, but it became very hard for these guys to square up the building just on two offsets, but that's what the contract was. So on, on, on any stake, you're gonna have an offset. You're gonna have what, what it's offset to. Um, and if there's an elevation, you're probably gonna have a grade to something. Um, so this is, again, in regards to homes, buildings, building envelopes, um, normally things are graded to the uh, finished floor or the pad, but that's it. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Survey on.